My dad was supposed to be here. Has anyone seen my dad? I am your father. Do your homework. <laughs> To celebrate the release of Rise of Skywalker, we are going to recreate one of the opening scenes from the movie. And we're going to be using... Spiro! That's right. Asia and I brought in all of our Spiro family. family. Now, Asia, let's show everybody what we're going to be using. Yeah! RVR! RVR and... Yes, RVR. Oh! Oh, we have two new bolts. Planet! Spiro yep. 2.0. Yoda! Baby Yoda. And... Doesn't have a name yet. Jaja Ping. We're going to use the RBR as the... Millennium Falcon. Very good. And our bolts as... TIE Fighters. TIE Fighters. Our little Spiro 2.0s. Planets. Planets. And finally, we're going to use uh, this as Darth Vader's, or my TIE Fighter. He'll be patrolling around the area. Asia is going to create some code where we have the Millennium Falcon, or the RVR, is going to drive around our little stage and the bolts are gonna act as TIE Fighters and they're going to chase him. Yeah. Here you go, okay. you do the honors. This bolt. How do I? Like this. Ooh. See, like this. Ah. All right. So, one of the things we really love about the new Spiro bolt, besides, besides the IR sensors, is this tiny little uh, eight by eight matrix screen. Ah, uh, yeah, there's a matrix screen here. That's right. So we're going to be using the matrix screen to add a little bit of animation, a little bit of color to our project today. Uh, this is an old one, but a good one. Uh, this is Spiro's cousin, Ali Darkseid. He's not waterproof, but, but he is a lot cooler because he's a lot faster. And last but not least, we'll take that today, is our RVR. favorite RVR. All right. And again, if you haven't, if you'd like to know more about the RVR, we have a video. Check out that video up here somewhere. And uh, alrighty, so now let's get coding. Coding! Millennium Falcon. In RVR, we will code the TIE Fighters. So, the RVR is the RVR Millennium Falcon. We will code the program in the RVR Millennium Falcon. code RVR Millennium Falcon. Broadcast channels 0 and 1 it is meant to message you got a water that put in the garden yeah so you know they will go but it's in a guy out so don't bother that you can go you know okay you go look forever if you're saying you know kids are talking look for my daughter you go and then speed so don't you are if you are got our man can find us up to the second speed they're talking to now me the spin to a jugu Spin, stop for Google. For send a message. So let's send a message. Okay, we're send a message. Send a message. Uh huh. Yep. And we're going to use uh, channel seven. Now, the Spiro has, can use seven different channels. So, in reality, if you had seven bolts or seven RVRs, <laughs> uh, you could communicate with all of them. So, you can believe me, Falcon Code, you can see it. You can see both code and video. So, why don't we uh, test? Do it. Okay. Yeah, we'll literally to... do the Star Wars adventure. So we're going to move over to our little Star Wars area and uh, we'll be right back. Three, two, one, action. Okay, so the TIE Fighters follow Oh, get him. Get him. As you can see, the Millennium Falcon is uh, driving around in circles. 
And the TIE Fighters are receiving their communications from the Ammonian Falcon and they're chasing him. But not that chasing him fast enough. Ah, uh, yeah, that's, well, why don't we fix that? Okay. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to add a speed, bu uh, speed block and that hopefully will get the TIE Fighters to follow a little faster. <laughs> way faster. Yep. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh, there it goes. Way faster. Oh, there it goes. Okay, uh, probably another reason why it's not following so fast is because the bolts don't have the best grip on the green screen. But Ollie has no problem moving on the carpet. Get him, Ollie, get him. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> it's supposed to shoot. Do they watch in the After Effects? We'll add After Effects to make them shoot. <laughs> 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 그럼 이제 진짜 스타워즈를 보러 가시죠.